My name is Shunya Takahashi. I'm the manager of a convenience store. Actually, I've been having some problems lately. Thank you. Again? This feeling like someone's staring at me. Ugh, it's kind of creepy. I started feeling someone's eyes on me a little while ago. I looked in the direction where the stairs were coming from, but there was no one there. So maybe I'm wrong, but... Could it be a ghost? Shunya, hurry up and pay the bill. My lunch break is short, and I'm busy. Oh, uh, sorry, Torio. This is Torio Habai. He's my best friend, or rather, we've been inseparable since elementary school. He's working hard as a salesman now. What are you dozing off for? Is the store about to go under? No, it's not that. I'm just having a little trouble. Fine, I can spare a little time. I'll take you out for a drink tonight. Thanks. That night... Possessed by a ghost? How would that be possible? I don't really believe in stuff like that either, but... I can't figure out what's looking at me. We did that test of courage thing when we were kids, but no ghosts appeared, right? You've always been a scaredy cat. How pathetic. The test of courage? The one you ran away from and left me behind at? I was so scared. When we went to another school's festival, you went away with a group of girls without me. Don't complain about the past. You're such a pathetic guy. Torio has never changed. He invites me out for drinks, and he says he's my best friend, so I can count on him like I did today. But there are times when I wonder if he actually thinks of me as a friend. Would you like another drink? I can get you one right now. Yes, please. She used to spew beer all over the place, but she's turned into a very capable waitress. Oh yeah, listen. Last month, I won first place in sales. I get contracts with companies that are hard to crack. The drinking session ended listening to Toryo Saga before I knew it. I made the mistake of talking to Toryo about it. But I don't have many friends I'm still in touch with, and I don't know about cutting ties with Toryo. What? It's unlocked. Welcome home! Surprise! Ah, a ghost! What are you talking about? It's me, Rena. Did you forget you gave me your key? I called you too. Sorry, I wasn't looking at my phone. I didn't think you'd come today. This is my girlfriend, Rena Arai. We've been dating for six months. Rena works in the bookstore next to my store. Hello. You're the manager of the convenience store, right? You like that series? Uh, yes, it's my favorite series that I've been following for a long time. We became close through talking about our favorite books, and then one day, I gathered up all my courage and confessed my feelings to her, and she said yes! I still can't believe that someone so cute and lovely is my girlfriend. I liked your black hair before too, but this color suits you too. You're really cute. Why are you dating me? <laughs> Thanks. Because I like the way you say things like that. Oh, by the way, did you have drinks with someone today? Oh, yeah. I was talking to Torio about how I've been feeling like someone's been watching me lately. I ended up listening to his saga, though. I don't care about Habai-san's stories, but... I'm curious about that stare. It's not like I actually think it's a ghost. But I feel a gaze. And when I turn around, there's no one there. I have an idea. Let's watch a horror movie and build up your tolerance. What do you think? That's a good plan, don't you think? Your plan is to build up courage, huh? Isn't it because you want to watch it? I mean, that's part of it, but... Oh, come on, just sit down. Ah! Behind you! Behind you! How did he not see it? They've been behind you! Ah! It's 
so cute, she scared herself. I really like her. I'll take good care of her. Shunya, are you watching? I'm looking at you because it's scary. A few days later, I went to visit Rina's place. Welcome! Last time we watched a ghostly horror movie. So today, we're going to watch a zombie movie. Hey, so you're determined to watch a horror movie? I'm going to make some tea, so just sit around and wait. I bought some donuts that you wanted to eat, so let's eat them together. <laughs> Magazines all over the place! This is a magazine for preparing for marriage! We haven't talked about it at all, but I'm 30 and Rena's 28. It's not surprising that she's thinking about marriage. Here's some tea. Shunya, wait. No, I'm not trying to rush you into marriage. But since I've been seeing you, I've been having these dreams. I'm just getting ahead of myself. You don't have to worry about anything, Shunya. Really? Anyway, donuts! <laughs> Thanks, I really wanted to eat some. <laughs> Rena said so, but she even bought a magazine. That means she's positive about our future. I thought six months was too soon, but I want to be with Rena forever. I decided to make a big decision. A few weeks later... Thanks for the food. It was all delicious, but what's the matter? Taking me to such a nice restaurant all of a sudden. There is something important I want to tell you, Rena. I want to establish myself as a man. Please marry me. I will make you happy for the rest of our lives. Is that okay? Did I put pressure on you, Shunya? No, it's not that. It's a decision I made on my own. I want to be with you forever. I'm the one who should be thanking you. I won't ever take off this ring, Shunya. You have to wear it all the time, too. Yeah, I won't take it off. And that's how I got engaged to Rena. But that man immediately noticed my engagement ring. Uh, what? Shunya? You're into fashion? Don't tell me that's an engagement ring! It is an engagement ring. I proposed the other day. No way. That's not true, is it? Hey, is it that girl with the short black hair you were telling me about? That's right. There's no point in lying. Oh, Rena doesn't have short black hair anymore. Oh well. I don't need to correct it. Be careful not to get thrown away! See you later! Are you serious? I thought for sure they'd break up soon. I can hear everything you're saying. Torio exited the restaurant, looking very impatient. What? Habai-san said that? That's terrible. He doesn't even know how much I like Shunya. That's just how he's always been. Kind of condescending. Anyway, have you decided on which wedding venue to go with? What should I do, Shunya? There are so many wonderful places. Oh, I can't decide. Can't we have a wedding in multiple locations? No. Don't give me that look. No? No, we can't. Despite all the worries and doubts, the wedding preparations continued to progress. When we got to the stage of deciding who to invite, we asked Torio as well. Shunya, you're so sweet. Unlike you, I don't have many friends, Rina. I see. I'm going to try on some dresses. Okay, I'll try to contact Torio while I'm waiting. Hello, Torio? The date of the wedding was decided. Oh, sorry, I can't. I have something really important to do that day. Oh, really? Is it work? Nah, it's a very private thing. Look forward to it on the day, Shunya. Torio declined and said something that seemed to include some meaning. I'm a little curious, but oh well, 
Rena, your wedding dress is amazing! I want to make a photo book! No, I can't decide which one is my favorite! Uh, which one do you like best, Shunya? From one end to the other, please! We don't do that kind of service. And so, it went on to the wedding day. I'm starting to get nervous. I need to be more responsible since I'm going to be Rina's husband. Oh, it's a call from Torio. I'm going to marry your wife. Huh? What the hell are you talking about? Torio-san, I love you. Are you with the woman? That voice sounds familiar. Shunya, are you ready? Oh, my heart is racing. Huh? Who are you calling? Don't try to act cool, okay? You're upset because you lost your bride, aren't you? Sorry, but I took your wife. Uh, I think you're mistaken, but our wedding is about to start. What? You told me to look forward to it, but is it a surprise? You gotta stop making jokes. I'm hanging up now. What is that? I don't know. He said he's getting married to you, Rena. What is that? Oh, whatever. The wedding staff said they'll explain everything, so let's go listen. We began to prepare for the wedding. And then, we finally got to the part where we kiss. Kissing while everyone's watching. <laughs> it's embarrassing. Sorry if I'm not good at it. WAIT A SECOND! Torio? What are you doing here? I fell in love with you at first sight. I make more money than Shunya, and I can make you happy. So please marry me! What are you talking about? Stop! What right do you have to interfere with my love? Come on, come on, elope with me! Can you please stop? I don't know you, and you're not my type. Who do you think you are to ruin someone's wedding? Who do you think you are? I found you, Torio-san. What are you doing here? You're from that store. I'm Rumi Agadashi. Shunya-san, you helped me out when I spilled beer that one time. I liked you since then. Huh? I've always watched you from afar. But then I found out you have a wonderful girlfriend. I gave up. Could it be? The person whose gaze I felt was hers? And at that moment, Toriyasan approached me and spoke to me. I was so relieved. I will never let you go. Let's continue with the ceremony now. No, wait, wait, that's not it! I thought you were Shunya's girlfriend, so I... You're so shy. Agadashi-san dragged Torio away. A love born from heartbreak. Oh, how wonderful! Shunya, I won't ever let you go either. Uh, yeah. I'll always be by your side, Rina. So Toria was trying to make a move on Rina. Despite such troubles, our wedding ceremony ended successfully. Rina and I happily became husband and wife. One day, a week after the turbulent wedding, I haven't heard from Torio lately. No, that's the guy who was trying to steal Rina away. Why should I care? Who's that? Torio? Shunya, please, I'm begging you, help me! You're the only one I can count on! Speak of the devil. What happened to you? I asked him to come in since I didn't want him yelling in front of my house. It's Rumi. She's crazy. She's been watching me 24 hours a day. She's got a GPS tracker on me, and she checks my phone every day. 
just because I came home a little late yesterday, she thinks I'm cheating on her. She just loves you. Take responsibility and make her happy. I'll go crazy if I stay with her! Please, just let me stay here until things cool down. We're best friends, aren't we? We've been friends since elementary school! I've known Torio for a long time and he's one of my few friends, but this guy tried to take Rina. Ah! She's already chasing me! Shunya, please, please tell her I'm not here! You can't fool her if you're being followed by GPS. Huh? Isn't that my son? You're Shunya's sons. Is that what this is about? Huh? You weren't satisfied with just Shunya's son. So you seduced Torio's son? You brought him into this room when Shunya's son wasn't around, didn't you? Oh, please calm down. I didn't do anything like that. I'm devoted to Shunya. Rina and Agadashi-san just ran into each other at the front door. They're arguing so loudly, I can hear them in the room. If we don't do something, Rina might get hurt. Come on, you're a nice guy, right? All you have to do is tell Rumi I'm gone. You mean to tell me that a man who tries to steal another man's girlfriend is a best friend? That was just an impulse uh, or jealousy. Let's let bygones be bygones, okay? I'm Rina's husband now, and I have to protect her first. I can't be stuck with some guy who's been using me for his own personal gain. I should have done this a long time ago. Hey, what the hell are you doing? Let go of me! You hear me, Shunya? You're not my best friend, and I'm done with you in this whole rotten relationship. Shunya! I handed Torio to Agadashi-san and told her what had happened, and the misunderstanding was quickly cleared up. She's a bit strange, but she seems to be a sensible person. I'm sorry for the trouble I've caused you. From now on, I will keep a close watch on him. No! 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 I'm sorry for everything I did. I'm so tired. Thanks for that. You were so cool today, Shunya. You did that for me, right? I thought the only way to protect you was to hand over Torio. I couldn't sleep that night. I kept thinking if it was the right thing to do, cutting Torio off. It was the right thing to do. He might try to get his hands on Rina again. Hmm? What are you doing in here? Hmm? We're a couple. We can sleep together. You can use me as a pillow. <laughs> Thanks, Rina. What happened to Torio after that? I saw him severely emaciated recently. Torio, I will be with you forever. You can't get away from me, Torio. He's not as flirtatious as before. Yeah. Thanks, Ruby. <laughs> and since I cut Torio off, a small change has occurred in my daily life. Um, would you like to have some tea with me? You saved me from that scary looking guy the other day, didn't you? I've been thinking about you ever since. Oh, I appreciate the kind words, but I have a wife I love very much. Oh, that's too bad. I've never had anyone come on to me like that before. What? Did someone hit on you again? I'm worried. Don't worry, Rina. I love you the most- WHOA! What was that?! It's a cat. <laughs> I think I like how you're a little timid. Come on, Rina. I want to become strong to protect you. Oh, want to watch a horror movie again? There's a new one that's supposed to be really scary. You're scared of it too. I'll hold on to what's really important. Thank you for watching all the way to the end. Hope you enjoyed today's episode.
And don't forget to check out our other episodes, too. According to my calculations, you are about to like and subscribe to our videos. Thank you for watching! See you next time!